Okay, we're vid finishing up our friend Journey's video. We got a couple of days left here. And what you see is the dog is in a crate with a leash out. So it's all about relaxation and setting boundaries for the dog. So what a dog do needs, this dog, needs leadership. Leadership is not yelling and screaming. It's about an attitude, a projection on how you... So now Jackie is going to open Journey's crate where, by the way, the dog gets all of its meals, but she doesn't come out without being released. Jackie's gonna say, okay. Okay. And the dog comes out. Jackie's gonna love her only when her four feet are on the ground. Stand up. She's gonna pick up a leash. So, good girl, eat good. So she corrects bad behavior, look. Then she can, uh, and praise good behavior. So she took the dog out. Now we're gonna have a little play time in here. So you're gonna drop the leash and say, okay and get low and there's where the play is so she activates the play by getting low leash and collar on all the time the dog's not allowed to jump here's food she corrects bad behavior and she loves good behavior i'm gonna go sit on my couch with my food not her food this isn't hers so she set this boundary is set i don't know if you can see this all right, we're gonna go into another, our classroom and just go over all these basic things. It's about adjusting energy. Notice Jackie is just standing there. The leash and the collar is on. We're not holding the collar, we're not restraining her. Get low and the dog will come. She just got low, there's not talking. Dogs don't talk. The human language is, is, they don't communicate in human. She loves, 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 she got low. Now she's gonna stand up. And that's the end of it. She's going to put my food back onto the kitchen cabinet. The dog can't jump. What will we do if the dog jumps? Well, correct, but we don't have to. Okay, we're going to cut. The leash and collar is on. There's no problem. Journey is not, his tail hasn't, her tail hasn't stopped wagging. She's a happy dog that needs boundaries. Jackie's going to, we're going to go outside, so she's going to pick up our leash. She's going to ask the dog to heal, which means come to her left. She's gonna to walk towards the door. She's gonna to come to a stop, ask, good. She's gonna step out with her right foot and open the door. The dog don't go out. She's gonna get ready to go. She steps out with her left foot and the dog goes, period. Let's go out and watch. Okay, so here we go for a walk. The dog places in the pack be, be, uh, to her left and slightly behind her. She can go fast, she can go normal, she can turn right. Good, the dog follows. When the pack leader comes to a stop, she slows down, the dog SITs. She pets and that's it. When she's ready to move, her left foot walks, there's no talk, and the dog gets up and goes, no matter what. Keep going. Good dog, it's a little hot, and she's tired, she plays all day, she lives a good life. Slow down. Come to a stop, ask her to sit. Step out with your right foot. Right foot, drop the leash. Step away. So the right foot in stops the dog from moving. She's gonna go back and love the dog now. No treats, this is for natural love. Positive reinforcement, steps out with her left, the dog moves. And again, the dog adapts to the body, the human. The human don't adapt to a dog. A blind person can't adapt to a guide dog. The dog has to adapt to the human. Through consistency, consistency, there's never tension on that leash. There hasn't been tension on that leash in 11 days. And that's the core of all the problems. We're gonna go inside and demonstrate that. Okay, now we're back from our walk. Nothing changes. If you see Jackie, she's not talking to the dog. She's not begging or having a human conversation. She's just gonna give the dog free time by saying, okay, getting low, and dropping the leash. And then she walks away. And you see there's all kinds of distractions in our house. There's dogs, there's all kinds of things, food, toys. Obviously this is in our house, but we use this to demonstrate how you set boundaries. Now Jackie is tired, she's met all the dog's needs. She's gonna go sit down and relax for a minute. She goes onto a couch. The dog is investigating everything. Pretty soon Joe, oh, okay. But balance, normally Joe would be barking, but we teach them not to, not by being. 
and my little friend Journey's going around making friends, and that's fine. Jackie is sitting on the couch. She's not worried about the dog, nor can the dog come and harass her. So I'm gonna cut for a minute. So, when the human is where, in a human spot, which is the couch, the dog can't go there. So you're gonna squeak your toy, which what is a squeaky toy? It's like a dead animal. And where's Journey? All right, you can throw it. I think she was supposed to see it. She goes up there, I'm gonna correct her. She starts because she smells food. Here's the food, I see it. Um, all right, now ja there goes the dog. Pick up, there's a squeaky toy by your feet. Good girl, good girl, good girl. Now pick up your leash. Ask her to leave it. Journey, leave it. Good, good, good. She corrected her, picked it up, pick it up. She, she's not going to bother you. Good. Throw it. Tell her to go fetch. Just let her go. Fetch. Good girl. Okay. Good girl. Okay. All right. So she just doesn't know this game. All right. So that's fine. Now Jackie wants the lover. She stands up. Notice the leash and collar is always on. She gets low and the dog comes to her and she loves her. She don't touch her or look at her and do anything when she's in a human space. So this is simple and we'll go out and knock on the door. And the dog is just doing what dogs do. Doorbell rings. Dog's not reacting. The only way a dog is gonna react if I start yelling and screaming. The company comes in, come in. Hi. Hi. How are you? Come in. And then, yeah, go have a seat. I'll bring you a cup of tea. The dog can't go there. Can't harass her. Can't jump. Here's some food. Have a piece of nice food, Jackie. So what are we doing? We're setting boundaries by being consistent. Journey girl. Yeah, 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 yeah. Journey girl. Hey, hey. Ashbeth. Ashbeth. Journey. Yeah, she come, but she can't cross a boundary. She corrects her off. Good. That's what we want to do. So we're setting her up for failure. Jackie has food. The dog knows it. She called her. Just because she called her doesn't mean the dog's supposed to jump on our lap. All right, we're going to cut and just go over a few things. So here we go. So now we're preparing food in the kitchen. Jackie has some nice Italian bread with garlic on it. And she's working around. The dog has got a leash. When the dog jumps, if she does, she's going to get corrected. There's the food. And it's good, trust me. But she's not jumping. So Jackie's making food. Blah, 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 blah. The dog smells the food. Eh, eh, off. And she was correct. That's the end of it. She'll not do that again. So that's how we resolve counter surfing. It's all about human energy. We correct bad behavior. And we love praise good behavior. Right, Jackie? So in conclusion, Journey, leash and collar's on all the time. You don't have to hold it. They can't be stressed. You can't be doing this. They can't be restrained. We love her. I'm loving her in a neutral place. I'm not doing this on a couch or by the kitchen table. All your issues are related to lack of leadership, dog leadership. Leadership is not yelling and screaming and holding her and restraining her. We play when appropriate. But it's our game, not her game. So she can play, she can do all these wonderful things. When I say leave it, she needs to leave it. Watch, she's playing. Journey, leave it. Okay, girl, okay, girl. Good girl, now watch. Watch, leave it. Journey, simple, and then I love her. So this is my toy, not her toy. I share it with her, leave it. Love, love, love. Balanced energy, not her leading the roost. She's capable of this. This is a wonderful dog. It's about uh, correcting bad behavior. Watch, Journey, leave it. That's a correction. It's, uh, uh, God, she comes to me, I love her. Positive reinforcement, this isn't done for food. No food for this. The only time she gets a morsel of food is when she goes in her crate voluntarily. Does everybody, this is simple. Keep your energy balanced. 
It's not about yelling and screaming. It's, look at these dogs. Normally they would be barking. We taught them not to. They're in training. Joe. Everybody. We're all balanced energy. So uh, just follow our videos. Any questions you call us, it's about relaxation, not anything. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do that, not her. I activate her. She doesn't activate me. Good, babe. Cut.